how do you learn new skills do you follow a system slash process that helps you learn efficiently um yeah uh, when it comes to skill uh, there's only a single thing i believe is that you have to put hours like any skill can be learned you have to put hours and that hours i know is widely thrown number that is 10000 hours i don't have any specific number but what i would do is that put more and more hours for example let us say i get into jiu jitsu now now only thing that i've done in martial arts so far is striking i've done karate i've done taekwondo i've done muay thai kickboxing and uh, i don't know if i mentioned taekwondo or not but but all are striking okay boxing and all these are all striking and never did much of like jiu jitsu or wrestling i want to get into it and when i ultimately do get into it then my whole mindset would be like i have to put an hour every day that's my mindset at least an hour every day maybe more on the weekends and the reason i say this is that because i know in let us say first month or even first year i would be horrible at it like i would be at the bottom of the food chain kids are going to be doing better at it and i'm going to be choke getting choked left and right okay uh but at that point i have to remind myself that i still have to put the same amount of hours that's where most people mess up like when they are not seeing themselves doing well they kind of shy away or say that i'm not for this or something like that so that's what you have to keep in mind when it comes to developing any skill is that you have to put in the hours just keep on adding the hours and yeah any skill takes years years 100 percent. there's no skill you're learning within oh i think that's the next question <laughs> okay there's there's no skill that you're going to be learning within months years like saying a couple of years is also uh, underestimating that i'm just being very optimistic that there might be some skills but most of the skills like it takes like two three four years for you to develop same with writing like i i started to pursue being a writer from the scratch i was an engineer by profession i was i was horrible at writing and grammar and spelling in general i'd never done writing before but when i picked up a pen which is just um figuratively because in in actuality i picked up my laptop and started typing i was like oh this is bad and and most of the time uh, i felt like okay maybe i can't do it but then i reminded the same thing like just put in the hours i put just one hour every day and like within three four months my book got a structure and actually the same thing is happening right now uh, because i'm writing working on my second book right now and what is happening is like I went from the I think 15th draft of this book to the first draft of my second book. So this is like polished and and perf- like almost to the point of perfection this book. And I'm like, "Oh, I'm a great writer." And then I start writing my new book and I'm like, "I'm I'm horrible <laughs> because because this does not look that good." So I remind myself the same thing, just forget about everything, forget about the results, put hours every day. And uh, I think in the past couple of weeks things started to turn out that's when i did a community post too that the second book has really picked up and uh, now when i look at it oh it got like eight chapters there's like a beginning there's an end there's a twist over here oh we got everything down now it's only like again continuing hours and hours and hours and doing like the second draft the fifth draft the tenth draft and just the same process so that's what you need to learn about skill Uh, it is very repetitive don't look uh, look for the rewards you just have to keep on going sorry to say that but that's how it works and the third one is the one that got me what skills do you think are worth learning not soft skills okay so i'm not going to say that hard skills which make people money directly (laughs) so i think uh this guy or girl whoever it is um by now also got the answer that there's no such skill it does not work out like that like makes money directly bro even if you're a porn star there's going to be a steep climb for you to make your name in that industry even if you are uh, 
you 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 started an only fans okay you're an extremely attractive person and you started an only fans i'm i'm pretty sure i never done that so i do not have first hand experience but i'm pretty sure it's a tough fight to to make your place over there and and to consistently make significant amount of reward so you can pick any career it is going to be the same struggle it's going to be failures and it is going to be like you just uh, optimizing yourself to a point where your skills are golden and you have set yourself apart from others and now people know that you are in demand and they want to pay you big money and when i say long time it's again sorry to say it's years and a lot of times decades and people who have been in the same industry for decades they will say that yes sir i'm 50 years old and i still learn every day and that's what you have to get used to you you can't ultimately look for how oh, what do i do so that i get money and flow for the rest of my life and that's the mindset you need to develop for yourself again no offense but this is what i believe 